Suppressor T-cell, what is it that you do? As a suppressor T-cell, also known as a T-reg cell on occasion, I help regulate the immune responses of a body. I can suppress cells that should never see action. If a cell is going to react against self, in other words, if an immune cell is going to attack a cell of the own body, I inactivate it. And I also help cells mature and develop in the appropriate responses. So I have a lot of regulatory functions. Helper T cell, what is it that you do? I'm a helper T cell. I secrete a number of local hormones like interleukins which activate other cells of the immune system. It's all part of the checks and balances approach. You see B cells or cytotoxic T cells aren't supposed to react to antigens on their own. That way if they don't have permission then we can prevent autoimmune diseases and immune cells attacking cells that they shouldn't. It's only when I give these cells permission that they can then do their job and mount an immune response. I am a permission giver and very little of the adaptive immune system functions without my help. B cell, I notice you've bound an antigen but you're not dividing and you're not making antibodies. What is it that you're doing? What are you waiting for? I cannot divide because no one has given me permission to divide. B-cell, I give you permission to divide and start the humoral response. Now that I have permission from the T-helper cell, I can divide and plasma cells can start to make antibodies. Cytotoxic T-cell, I notice you should be attacking that abnormal cell. What are you sitting around doing nothing for? What are you waiting for? Well, I can't kill this cell unless I have permission. They don't let me just run around the body killing cells, you know. So until I'm given permission, I'm going to sit here and not do anything. Killer T-cell, I give you permission to kill that abnormal cell. Now that I have permission, I get to do my job. I can kill this abnormal cell.